Howdy hey, this is Frackbox, and I'm here with True Blue Blur. Long time no see. And also special guests are Batman. Well, Batman, what are we going to do today? We're going to stop the Joker! Of course. Uh, so, let's let's uh, continue beating the Joker. Let's see here, I think slowly. I need to go down here. We took out all the dudes, right? Uh-huh. Okay. There so, were only three. So now we need to rescue uh, the last doctor. Is this the right? I don't think that's right. Uh, that was not right. What what was that? Um, what was the exclamation point about? Oh, do you have to go that's, in the that's elevator? That's where I'm going. Yeah. Oh, you have to go in the elevator. Okay. I just went in the wrong door. Okay, so you had to go in here and take care of these guys so you can go in the elevator. Whoops. <laughs> so you can go get the last doctor. Yeah. Okay. No, I, I, I'm pretty sure I saved the last doctor. We're moving on to the next thing now. Really? I thought we only saved, like, two doctors. No. I, I think last time it was last session. Yeah. Where is the elevator door? Am I facing the right way? I, even? I, I thought, yeah, I, am. I think okay. it's just up. It must be. Yeah. I think it's to the... In here. I think it's, so, It's yeah. over here. Yeah. To the more. Could you... Not. No. Where does he get all these... No. Um, like, the money he needs in order to <laughs> buy all of these, uh, the mouth clacker things. Must be a lot of money. Because, I mean, if... Yeah, probably. Like, even if they only cost, like, a dollar. Uh, yeah. That's still a lot of dollars. Although he's probably rich. I wonder how rich the Joker is. I mean, he he has probably a lot of money. Yeah. Somehow I'm not concerned. Did he just stop the elevator? No, he started it. We were just sitting there that whole time while he babbled. You know, if if the Joker really wanted to, uh oh. Yeah. Uh-oh. That's that's significant. <laughs> yeah, if the, if the Joker really wanted to stop you, he could just, like, keep you in the elevator. Yeah. He doesn't want to, though. What's going on here? Oh, is this the, is the Joker toxin getting... Oh. Nope, it's not. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. If that were Superman, he could, he could <laughs> just bend the bars. Maybe we should just wait. You right. <laughs> well, I mean, it's not really a, not really a city. <laughs> it's more of an island. Oh, well, we're. He means Gotham. Oh, gotcha. Arkham is on an island, but it's Gotham city limits. Yeah. Isn't Gotham... It's an allegory for New York. Right, but it... it, it... Whoa. Help me, Batman! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, wasn't it also from, like, H.P. Lovecraft? I think, um, I think Gotham was... I don't know the answer to that. I think Gotham was, like, a city that... Like H.P. Lovecraft, like was in his writings, maybe, and they basically used it. That I mean, that seems like Batman. something that that uh, DC would absolutely do is uh, use something like that to pay homage. Yeah. Also, I think like Arkham, like the Arkham Asylum, I think is also uh, a concept. Yeah. That came from H.P. Lovecraft's work. Uh oh, that's Jim Gordon. He's dead. That's what it says. Did he really just kill Go Commissioner Gordon? Uh oh. I'm sorry, Jim. Jeez. Things are not what they appear. Oh. Is this? I'm sorry. Oh, it's all we're getting all tilty. Yeah. Oh, he's having an acid trip. <laughs> Basically. It's uh, Scarecrow's fear toxin. Oh, gotcha. Isn't Batman, like, 
immune to the fear toxin by now? If he takes the antidote. Oh, okay. It has an antidote, but he's not just innately immune to it. At this point, you think Batman would be aware that the fear toxin was happening? Or yeah, are... he hasn't caught on, which is probably because of the fear toxin. So are we going to fight Scarecrow? Uh, yes, not right away, though. Oh, gotcha. So Scarecrow is also working with the Joker. Yeah. Is that unusual? Not necessarily. Okay. Fine, I'm leaving. Shut up. Okay. <laughs> just Batman casually walking. All right, well, this is normal. I normally hear just voices. Oh, oh and that door leads to a different place than when we walked in. I think it's the... S it, oh. is, it is, in fact, the same room, but with body bags. Hmm. I guess some something probably going to jump out of the body bag. Yep, okay, it's moving. <laughs> I wonder what's in there. Father. Oh. Like a man. That's an amazing preservative. <laughs> <laughs> Looks so lifelike. Yeah. <laughs> it's like he died yesterday. Mom? Help us, Bruce. Don't let us die. He gets a little bit late. I know, right? <laughs> Is that, is that the Scarecrow? It is, in fact, the Scarecrow. Oh. Nothing was there. Oh. Everything's there. <laughs> All we'd have to do is just add, like, a filter effect, and this could be uh, Twilight Princess. <laughs> yeah. This will just be the top of the... Top of the castle. Yo. Um, I can't make that. Can I? Maybe. Oh, you, you, maybe you can shoot onto the... I just tried. It's like, oh, no. You can't. Nope. Go! Okay, oh, I can. Yes, you can. Oh, cutscene time. Uh-oh. They're messing with your mind. Oh. They're really messing with your mind. <laughs> Yo. Does he have laser eyes? None of this is real. But you can still die. Oh. Well, I mean, it, you know. <laughs> it's kind of like, So you know. basically, I have to avoid his gaze by hiding behind as many things as I can. Oh. The laser eyes are just to let you know exactly where he can see. Oh, gotcha. I was hoping it was actually laser eyes. <laughs> well, I, I think it does damage like laser eyes would as well. Oh, I gotcha. can't remember. You just have to be careful. Hmm. So there's a, um, you ever seen, uh, what is it, Overly overly Sarcastic Productions? Uh, sounds familiar. I might have. They do, um, there's two people. There's blue and red. Okay. And he's kind of a history guy, and she's a, uh, like a mythology guy, Okay. I guess. Um, and they kind of just you know, go over various things that either happened or mythologies that happened in, in history. Yeah. And typically they do like a little, you know, like those cartoons that aren't really, you know, animated fully, but it's just like, it's like anim animets almost, like instead of animation, more of like a, um, cartoons with less frames, basically. Okay. All right. Like still frames that like tell a story, basically. Anyway, I'm, I'm going into way too much detail. So, <laughs> yeah. um, they did one where they explained, like, um, uh, what was it? Uh, Journey to the West. Gotcha, okay. <laughs> and there's this one phrase that Bryce referenced earlier today that was, um, uh, what was it? It was, um, a monkey being the polite person he was bowed, <laughs> b bowed to the four cardinal directions and then activated his laser eyes I, oh <laughs> <laughs> which is an actual part of the story that happens basically 
crazy. Because Monkey in that story is just okay. overpowered. Ridiculously overpowered. Oh, man. Have you found my dad? I'm fine. Had a little run in with Scarecrow, slowed me down. Oh, I can't open the door until this is done. So he is aware go. that um, Jim Gordon didn't actually die then. Uh, he is now. He's like, yeah, that, that probably didn't happen. <laughs> mm -hmm. Follow the uh, conspicuous arrows. Of course. But were those written? While I was in there, yes. Oh. It wasn't Gordon. Crane's gas must That's okay. It's just a, just a random guard. He doesn't matter. <laughs> Just random guys. They're trying to get in. They are. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming that after he finished. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> this guy with the knives. Is that a tracksuit? I don't know. You ever notice, well, why is it that, like, you know the, the stereotype where, like, uh, like, Eastern Europeans wear, like, tracksuits? Um, you know you know that? I don't, I don't think I've ever noticed that. No. Really? Oh, it's kind of a, I'm not sure if it's used to, like, make fun of them or anything. I don't know. But, like, it's kind of, like, especially, like, gangsters in media, mm. like, or like thugs who yeah. are like Russian or something. They'll like wear tracksuits. And it's kind of, okay. I don't know, I wonder where that came from. I don't know. Because it's, it's, you know, uh, there's this guy that I, um, uh, that I've watched on YouTube who kind of just wanders around places like in Russia. Okay. And there have also been just Russians in tracksuits. I see. And so I'm like wondering like, why? <laughs> I'm Interesting. Like, I'm Maybe like, they, they must just really like the way it looks. I guess. I mean, it, it's not. It doesn't look bad or anything. I'm just yeah. like, why is that a cultural thing? You know? <laughs> Who even knows? Yeah. I guess it's sort of you know, it's just you know, people wear you know whatever it is that's that's popular in the culture. So, I mean, there are worse things they could wear. I guess. So. Yeah. I don't know. I was just wondering, like, why? I don't know. You know, like Adidas. You know, like Adidas tracksuits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. I just have no idea. Yeah. I'll probably like look it up somewhere. Although I'm worried that if I look it up somewhere, I'm gonna get like a, like a, um, like an encyclopedia answer. Or oh something. yeah. It's always a possibility. Yeah. This guy. I need him to not be a thing. I need to make sure no one else can see me. It doesn't look like they can. Okay. And he's dead. <laughs> Let me in. Seriously, faster. Oh, she was talking about um, Commissioner Gordon. Jim, yeah. Oh, I guess there was another opening. I didn't need to do that. Whatever. Oh, that was Jim Gordon talking. Okay. It was. I was like, wait, that sounds kind of like Batman. Why is Batman talking? That was one of the easy ones. Oh, shut up. So the the Joker must really know where you are at all times. <laughs> he does have cameras. Hmm. He's got uh, access to the security cameras. Yeah, you know, oddly enough, I don't know if if somebody would make that sounds if they were choked like that. <laughs> Although I, 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 I don't plan it. Well, he's not choking. Um, he just covers their mouth and nose so they can't suck air in. Oh. Are there well, no gargoyles in here? I guess there's no gargoyles. They canceled that show a long time ago. <laughs> that was a fun show. Yeah. What was the name of the guy who, like, put the castle on top of his skyscraper like xanatos or something i don't remember that <laughs> because it's been too long he is xanatos <laughs> um yeah he was like this rich guy who decided to take the scottish castle and move it brick by brick on top of his skyscraper 
<laughs> yeah. Which is how the gargoyles got around, because they, they can't fly, they just glide. Yeah. <laughs> so being in the tallest the tallest building makes, makes things a little easier. Yeah, but he like shipped it across the Atlantic Ocean. Like the whole castle. <laughs> yeah. Like how rich do you have to be to ship an entire castle? I know, right? <laughs> oh my gosh. So crazy. Yeah. That was one of the, the good shows. It was, um, yeah. It was. I remember it being really great. I've been thinking about rewatching it recently. I have not uh, seen it in a long time. Yeah. There's a lot of shows that I've been meaning to watch. Um, the only real show that I've been like watching pretty religiously was Game of Thrones. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, I still uh, have not. Eventually. It's worth watching. Definitely. Yeah. Um, I'm on. I'm all caught up. Yeah. So by the time this airs, the last episode will probably already be out. Okay. Of, of the entire shebang. Yeah, yeah. So people were not happy about the, oh, the latest. Okay. Oh, there we go. Another Riddler thing. Yep. The funniest thing that I find about these these Riddler challenges is that <laughs> it's just thinking of the Riddler like sneaking, sneaking and, like, around and putting them all down. It's like this. Oh. So if we... Oh, it was just glass. I thought we yeah. had to do the... I didn't have to blow it up. He's out of control. He's trying to prove something. I'm not sure I can stop him this time. You'll do it. Batman, listen. We're not alone. He's got something else down there. What else has he got down there? Well, he doesn't know. Spoiling a surprise. Be quiet. Oh, am I getting to you? Am I? Good. <laughs> You're going to love this next Yeah, I mean, like, if, if I were Batman, the Joker does talk, like, a lot. Yep, yep. Like, a lot. Batman really doesn't like him, even just, like, having to listen to him. I mean, he, he does have... Uh, Oh shoot! What is his name? Um, the voice actor. Um, Which one? Of uh, uh, the Joker. Oh, Mark Hamill. I can't, I can't believe I forgot. So uh, he does have Mark Hamill's voice. Was it, is this Bane? <laughs> yep. Bruja, that's witch. That is witch in Spanish. So what is he going to do with Bane, then? He's going to pump him full. Oh, dear. So what Bane just said there is that, that one of the doctors we saved has actually been using his, the, the venom that makes him like this um, in her research to try and supposedly cure the patients. Oh, really? Yeah. So he's been a test subject for whatever that is. It's interesting. Is, is he not able to be taken out of... Like have, like the thing that feeds the the venom into him, is he not able to take that off then? Um, he, he I think he can, but you saw how skinny and scrawny he was. That's what he usually looks like. Right, gotcha. I mean, that really can't be healthy, to like make your muscles expand like that. Ooh, ooh, that okay, was okay. That was poor, poor timing on my part. That was a full like eighth of your health. Jeez. <laughs> Okay, I can't remember how to beat this guy. You know, why don't we actually go ahead and, and call this episode Okay, here? well, I'm going to pause it to do that. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, this is Frackbox. This is True Blue Blur. And this is Batman. I can't talk. I'm frozen. He paused it.